I'm doing a Ulta order unboxing haul, whatever the hell you want to call it. I got some sale shit from Ulta. That's, it is what it is. Okay. I think... I always hate how the little invoice thing doesn't have what I paid for things. That's always a pain in the butt. There was some type of coupon I used. I don't remember now because I waited a moment to get this stuff. But anyway. I got this uh, brush set. I think these are all for eye stuff. Though This kind of looks a little big as a blending brush. But yeah. Daily to find eye. Yeah, so. I think I paid $5 for that. I remember it being pretty cheap. I know these uh, little essence brushes were buy one get one half off. This has a weird extra piece of plastic coming off the back. Uh, these are like I got some smaller, more defined things though. This for like eyeliner. And then I got two of these little smoky eye brushes. And these are like smaller, come on, focus, smaller blending brushes. And then this a little more fluffy, bigger. Come on, don't look at me. Look at the thing. There you go. So. These were, buy one get one half off, so it was like $1.99 and the other ones were a dollar. Like, yeah. They ended up being like a buck fifty each. Uh, I got some of the Makeup Revolution concealer. Which, I have some of this, so I'm not going to open this one yet. I just got a backup. Um, of course, I keep... Getting these, uh, the, uh, J-Cat Rock and Glitz eyeliners. Uh, they finally had just the regular black one in. I'm not gonna open this yet, just cause I have black eyeliners that I'm working through. This thing does not want to focus today. Focus! Wow, it is being very picky right now. Let's see. The other one I got is, uh, silver. Oh, focus for that one, but not the other one. I will open the silver just to uh, show this one. Now I notice with these, the first couple swatches on this is not the best. I'm trying to get it to... I don't know if I quite like this one as much as I like the other ones. Like this one just looks kind of weird and milky and brown and does not look platinum to me. Yeah, that's probably my least favorite one of all the ones I've gotten. The pink was beautiful. There's like a rosy gold pink. It was way better than I thought that one was gonna be but yeah this don't don't get the platinum pop. All the other ones have been great. Actually, I have a scented a wipe I can use. I was gonna wipe my arm off, and of course, the little sticky thing, the tab broke. Way to go, CVS. Wow. Come on. This totally malfunctioned product. it. I'm gonna put it in a plastic baggie since this doesn't want to work correctly. Okay. Got that weird milky eyeliner off my hand. Other things I got, I got a couple uh, Makeup Revolution palettes that were 40% off. I got this colorful one. Uh, this was like four something because these are like the cheaper palettes. Okay. Apparently there's half a sticker on here. I am having trouble today opening stuff. I'm just the worst. Okay. Should open now. 
So let's open. I'm gonna see if this <clears throat> how this swatches. Now makeup revolution eyeshadows can be a little hit and messy. Eh, those aren't too bad. Let's see, I'm gonna do screw it. I'm just gonna do all of these. Ooh, I like that blue is nice actually. Fallout on the orange. A lot of it. The orange is nice though. You, you just gotta be careful with the fallout on that one. Eh, eh, eh. It's like this like hunter shiny green. I think most of these are metallic so they're probably gonna actually swatch pretty good. Ooh, that pink's nice too. Okay I'm not as I'm a little uh, surprised that this is actually coming out pretty good. <sighs> I kind of like expected this to be a little more um, crappy <laughs> just because of how cheap it is. I mean I've had cheap good stuff I'm just like the reviews on these are so hit and miss that I couldn't really find a specific review for this one because you know on the listing it just does there's like eight different of these reloaded palettes and when people review them it doesn't tell you which one they're reviewing unless the person puts which one they had issues with so you're left the guess are they talking about the one I want or are they talking about another one like the only one that was really, like, the first one was, first two were a little patchy, but these other ones actually came out pretty good. So that's this one. I mean, if you want a cheap, kind of colorful, slightly, some of these are shimmery, some of them have a sheen. But, I mean, that's not too shabby for that. I think the original price on those are 7 so even the original price isn't that bad if you, you know, don't use colorful stuff that often you want a cheap one just for like when you're wanting to do a specific eye look getting this crap off my arm because I bought a second palette now this one's a more expensive one because I think it's a collab palette it's the uh Makeup Lover, the Soap X uh, Extra Spice palette, which I have the original Spice palette and I like it. And usually, I would say usually when they have like these kind of collaborative palettes, they're usually better. So, pop this baby open. Plastic's getting stuck. Way to go. Okay. Finally got the plastic off. So this is, ooh, it's shiny. You can see everything. Look at my lights. That's the, uh, packaging. Wah! And this is the inside. Now, I mean, this is probably more like a neutral-ish palette, but I do like a lot of these kind of like uh, oranges and the shimmers. I'm usually not as much into more heavily neutral palettes, but I don't know. This one looks pretty to me. Gonna get another little wipe because I still have a little bit of orange on my arm. Okay, so I'll swatch this one too. Why not? Because this was really like the last thing I got. Now these ones are nice and smooth. Ooh, that's silver. What the hell? <laughs> I mean, what the hell in like a good way. Like, holy crap, silver. Come on. I'm trying to like, it doesn't want to focus for me. 
Browns are browns. That's definitely like a uh, transition or a base. Look at me acting like I know what I'm talking about. Ooh, it's like a shimmery orange brown. Let's see if this yellow is good. Eh, she's okay. She's alright. Got sweet and sour. It's a little in the orangey shade. I'm like pulling the sweater sleeve up. 21. Let's see. This red. Yeah, it's not too bad. He definitely. Uh, she's a bright. Pretty bright. Definitely a little more pink base red. We have Romance. Just a nice little shimmery baby. Oh, I accidentally hit romance again. Let me uh, clean my fingers off. Enchanted, which is a like mauvey brown. Lakes, which is a kind of foresty brown green. And the last row. It's like, I don't know how far I'm gonna be able to hike this sleeve up. Brownies, chocolate orange, which I love a good chocolate orange. Mold wine, that is definitely a wine color if I've ever seen it. La Sun, always a nice yellow gold. And then the last two, I'm just going to pop them higher back up on my hand because my sleeve is not going to go up any higher. It's already a little bit tight. Got that shiny green and then reputation which is like a darker green. And that's all the colors. Let's see if I can get this damn thing to focus on the silver. See that silver? That silver is awesome. This video is already like way longer than it really needed to be. <laughs> anyway, that's all the crap I got from Sephora on sale. I literally, I used my points and I only spent like $18, so. Subscribe if you want. Peace.